Welcome back. In this chapter, we'll walk you through how to export and interpret test reports in HTML, CSV, and PDF. You'll also learn the configuration for setting test reports via email automatically. When a test suite is executed, click on the Result tab, or you can go to Reports here. Then choose the test suite. Select Export Report. Let's go to HTML first. Select the location to save your report. Finally, click Open. And by default, the HTML report will be automatically opened on your browser. You can see here there are two main parts. The first one is the summary of the execution environment, including the host name, operating system, Canon version, and browsers. For the second part, at a higher level, is the test suite execution summary including the name, runtime, and final status. There are two tests here, and both passed. Below, it displays all the information of each test, including their summary and test logs, which are basically the execution details you're seeing here in the test case log section in Calon Studio. Similarly, you can export an HTML report for a test suite collection by following the same steps. Select Export Report, HTML, choose a place to save it, then open. It will open the report index displaying the overall results of the executed test suites. Select any suite to view its report, which is exactly the same as the one we've gone through earlier regarding the layout. Looking at the suite, for instance, it has four test cases. One failed. Expand, and you can see the root cause along with the test log message at the top. Or you can scroll down to the failed test steps and investigate the root cause directly from there. Seems like it failed because it was unable to set text of object. At the bottom, Calon Studio also captured a screenshot at the failed step, giving you more insights into the problem. On your local PC, you can see there are four exported HTML files, including the index and specific reports for each test suite execution. Simply convert the whole folder into a zip file and send it to your team members or managers via email to report on your testing process.